turn around and look at me. So Chester is one of two cats this week that are special. Uh, he's the first one. We'll be taking a look at Hermie in a little bit. But Chester is, um, he's only about 21 months old. He came to the shelter back in 2013 as a four-week-old kitten, went into foster care, got adopted, and was returned to the shelter for, um, the owner was describing uh, litter box issues. However, when we did some diagnostics, we determined that um, Chester sort of has a predisposition to developing urinary crystals. So what that means for Chester is that he requires a special diet. He will most likely require that lifelong, and he will also need annual vet checkups unless something um, is noted that, that he needs more frequent vet checkups. But nonetheless, I think sometimes when folks come to the shelter, they'll see the cage posted. We do that for his benefit to make sure that whoever's feeding him has information on what food he needs. Right now he's on something called SO diet. Um, but, you know, he's a great cat. He's affectionate. He's one of the cats that will drink out of the bathroom faucet if you let him. And being on a special diet does not preclude him from becoming, from being adoptable from our perspective, nor does it preclude him from being a lifelong companion for someone. So if you think of it this way, and this is the analogy I use during interviews, um, he requires a special diet, which is sort of the opposite is if you are allergic to something and cannot have a certain food, you just avoid it. Chester requires a certain food, so you just provide it. Um, the SO diet is not, not any more expensive than a good quality, um, high quality cat food. Um, it's just something that information that we disclose to adopters. But, you know, above all that, getting past the, the dietary requirement, um, he is affectionate. He was in foster care. He was around other cats. Um, he's been exposed to many people at the shelter. He's a great greeter cat. He will come to the front of his cage and greet you when you walk by him in the shelter. So very social, has acclimated well, relatively young. So we are really hoping that his diet requirement does not um, put people off, does not discourage potential adopters because we have him available and we are committed to finding him a home for forever. So that's what we are looking for from our potential adopters. But again, this is Chester looking for a forever home.